Hi, welcome to this tutorial. We're on Arch Merged. No, sorry, Arch Merged, that's what we're on. And we have um, i3 active and there's Polybar, so it's going to be launched pretty soon. And it's this bar rather than the four others, three others uh, bars we have. No, no, I think Polybar is the fourth bar possible on i3. And it looks quite awesome. You can see these colors, it's, it's nice. It's all in art theme as well. It's um, beautiful. But this tutorial is not about that. This tutorial is about explaining and uh, making sure that you know the application Melt. It's a super application. I've uh, heard on YouTube reviews that a lot of people don't know Melt. And this I have this great example ready now to show you the benefits of Melt. So Super F5 is what happens on our system. Then Melt is started. Uh, Melt is here. You can set the preferences. You can check that out. Make it solarized light and so on. Font's a bit bigger. So you check it out. Um, yeah, I am making this tutorial on i3. So keyboard shortcuts are important. So I've now activated them. So Control Shift Q, you hover over it, and something is active. Control Shift Q, gone again. Or Super Shift Q, yeah. Um, so I've just made a new polar bar uh, configuration. So I'm going to compare what I have and what's coming in from Archmerge. So that's what you should do with things in EDC Scale. If you did not change anything, it's just copy paste over. But if you say, oh, I have worked days and days on my configuration, I'm just going to check what Eric changed and what I have. So that is this tutorial. Melt, choose directory compar comparison. And then you say, in my re reasoning, it's always the same. This is mine. The right one is my system. So I'm going to navigate to the polybar and it's here eric.config polybar so right is mine and the left is coming from somewhere else so in this case it's in scale and in scale there is a config there's a polybar so when we update things that are in your home directory it's going to be an etc scale and then you just copy everything over like open box or, or termite or settings like that or you say well um, better compare well that's the wrong one of course talking about open box but polybar is the one we're going to compare two polybar folders one is coming from arch merge left and right is mine and as you can see there are some things to tell you well melt is one of the things you can do in melt is say give me the files so two folders are compared and i don't want to see the folders or the files that are the same so let's work also great to make uh, arch iso so the iso of Arch Merge is created similar ways. You compare two ISOs. For instance, I've taken Antergos, looked at it. I've taken Manjaro, looked at it. Uh, Swag Watch is quite interesting to look at it. So if you are into that, that's how you do it. You compare uh, the construction of an ISO. Um, right. So we have new. So remember, the left one is a new version. This is my version. I said, okay, this is new. So copy. To the right i have it now too spotify there's a new script in here copy to the right this actually um, you don't know that but this is actually replacing spotify because i've made a new script i've named it spotify one and spotify two so the spotify is called spotify one now and then copy to the right as well and here are some differences then you double click and you see what i did i added here a code minus one uh, it's I saw it was um, having two numbers and I said okay just one one number what what uh, don't need to do that so this code is better you can of course take a look at it what do you do like so Control C then you move to workspace two for instance Control T Control Shift V there you go and you see number of 25 meaning it's 25 degrees Celsius. So that's what this code does. So you can analyze and say, okay, I'm going for it. And that's all you have to do. Click on this arrow or right click and move it to the right. So, because this is my file. This is Arch Merges. 
And then I've changed some code, some lines. This line will color the icon too, and this line will not color the icon. So, okay, I'm gonna accept all these changes. Close up here, then it says, hey, you forgot to save. And you save it, and there's no difference anymore between these two. And if you reload, it's always interesting in the middle of the, your work to refresh. Then the only things that are different now is the weather pie. And that's also quite interesting. You get this uh, weather announcement uh, on your system, your polybar. So yeah, okay, copy to the right. I want to have that. The launch file, let's compare. So this is just a space. It was uh, collated here. So I was okay, not so nice. Up, oh, done. Then this was not so working very well in open box, so I made a new script, and this is a new script, so I accept all these changes, and that's it. Save. Again, white and white, if we refresh, it's gone. So the last thing to do to compare is the configuration file. This is an interesting option, screen change reload, false, true. So true means I do control S and I save something in the polybar, it's changed immediately. So that was, I'm quite happy to have found that. So that's in. And stuff like the monitor. I had some issues with the monitor. Fixed them. So new code is going in. We have a, not a mono regular for the CPU. If this thing goes down to 1%, that it doesn't change its place. It stays there at the same place. And that one is better. So what do you want to see in i3? So this is what we see in i3. That one, X window, network speed up, speed down, memory, CPU, and the date. That's all we want to see, it's enough. You can add more, of course, or delete these guys and change them with others. So basically, I'm gonna check what's to the left and do I want it or don't, will I not put it over to the right? since of course i've made this thing um, i said okay move everything over formatting has been fixed here a wrong pathway so this is a very old config compared with the, the latest newest config and that's why there are so many things in here that needs to be changed forgot something label font we've got rid of mocp so bye bye, I'm gone out of it, and we're actually just copy pasting or analyzing if we want to have the change from the left to the right in my own system. PA volume is a new one. Wrong pathway. Since we made uh, a second Spotify, I had to name it Spotify One and Spotify Two pointing to the right script, new layouts, nice icon, another icon that I like better coming from Interceptor because we've made it together, together with Nick as well. Three people have worked on Polybar and this is weather, yeah. So that's my point guys, um, analyze what comes in into your system see what's an etc scale uh, and see what the difference is i'm wondering if this is correct i think so because it's in here okay so this can go and just the space and some lines and there you go at some point it says files are identical and if you close up then it's gonna be saved if you press here of course if you reload then it says folder have no differences i've ex set, accepted all the differences coming from etc scale and the only thing you have to do is reload this uh, polybar and you'll see something else but this is about melt so please use it whenever something comes in and you've made a lot of work, then you can easily compare it with this application melt. Enjoy!